what our goal today is, is to have that hip step towards us. So I'm going to start out by having the horse walk along the fence. What I'm then going to do is I'm going to hold the rein with my left hand and kind of step not in front of the horse because if the horse decides to run over the top of me, that wouldn't be any good. So what we're going to do is step kind of in front um, of the horse but kind of to the side. I'm going to hold the dressage or the rein with my left hand in case that horse starts to go too fast, I can pull and make that horse stop. My right hand is going to be my cue to actually train the horse to have the hip step over. I'm going to start tapping. I'm going to keep tapping until the horse does that right there. Instantly, I stop tapping. The whole idea of the fence is that the horse wants to, be, to move away from pressure. Well, the fence being there, they can't move away from pressure. So he sits there and goes, wait, what, 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 what do you want? He finally steps into pressure and the pressure stops. The cue stops. Pretty soon he realizes that, okay, she wants me to move my hip in right there and I stop. I'm going to continue this, and it'll take about five minutes, maybe. Some horses, not that long, and some horses a tiny bit longer. But I just tap, continue my tapping, continue my tapping, continue, right there. Good job. Tap, right there gonna get quicker and quicker now if you watch. Right there. Good boy, Glenn. Good boy. That's okay to pet him and tell him, good boy. It's a good thing to tell your horses that you like them. They're too expensive not to like them. I'll keep going. Now what I'm gonna start to do is I'm going to start pre-cueing. My pre-cue is I'm gonna raise the whip going to kiss. If he doesn't move in, then I'll tap. The whole idea is I don't want to tap my horse. I don't want to always have to carry a dressage whip around. So I'm trying to teach them that I won't tap if they move beforehand. Good. Keep moving them. Good. Good. I wanted a more definite step there, so I waited. Good. I'm going to start asking for a little bit more. I'm going to stop a little bit and ask for one step. Now instantly ask for another. I'm not letting them back up by pulling on this rein. And right there, good job. Good job.
looking for a definite step. Horses go through period of time of where they go, no, that can't be possibly what they want, even though they did it 10, 15, 20 times. just start tapping as he takes one step tell him good job it's a little bit different because now we're above his head Uh, 
um, or the farrier. You know, generally I'm sitting on the ground with the farrier and the horse kind of steps away. Thank you again for all the likes.